Hello, this is Ghazi Rahman and today we'll be talking about the new B760 Ors Elite AX DDR4 motherboard from Gigabyte. This motherboard ships with the Intel LG A1700 socket which is meant for the new generation of non-K Intel 13 generation processors. So before continuing with the video, let's get some of the basic features out of the way. This motherboard comes with a dual BIOS system. So basically if the primary BIOS fails, the secondary BIOS will kick in and your motherboard will continue to work. The second feature is the PCI Metal Shield. So basically the latest generation of graphics card are kind of heavy. If you look at a 4080 or a 4070 Ti graphics card, those are very bulky graphics card. So to handle that much load on the PCI board, since we know that previous generation 1080 Ti were meant to bend the PCI board, a single slab of metal was placed on top of the PCI shield to bear that load. That is the basically the PCI metal sheet. It puts additional armor on top of the PCI slot so that it does not bend or break. Another feature for Gigabyte uh, motherboard is the SmartFan 6. Previously it was known as the SmartFan 5. The new additional features have been added and the upgraded version is called the SmartFan 6. So basically this motherboard comes with built-in sensors. Plus we have two sensor uh, port for additional outside data as well. So basically what SmartFan 6 does is it's going to take the data from all these sensors and it can uh, automatically adjust the casing fan provided that the casing fans are connected directly to the motherboard. It can automatically adjust the RPM of the casing fans, the intake and the uh, outtake of air to match the internal temperature as provided uh, by the user. So basically if you can uh, if you put a certain amount of temperature threshold within the system itself, SmartFan 6 will ensure that that temperature is maintained. So this motherboard is meant for the new Intel 13th generation non-K processors. So we know that the Intel has uh, went with a new hybrid technology for its non-K processor as well, which they previously did with the 12th generation K series processor, but they ignored it while uh, manufacturing the non-K versions. But for the 13th generation, the hybrid technology is present with the non-K processors that as well, so which is reflected with this motherboard as well. This motherboard comes with a 12 1 plus 1 digital VRM layout. So basically you've got 12 phases for providing direct uh, power to the processor itself and two 1 plus 1 cores that's meant for Intel built-in graphics and memory overclocking. So this is available with this board. And to cool this VRM down, Gigabyte went with a thermal guard design where the MOSFET is fully covered with a big chunk of aluminum heat sink which actively absorbs the heat from the VRM and the MOSFET and dissipate it within the computer system which is then picked up by the system fan and pushed out of the system, keeping the VRM very chilled while you do heavy workload. Orsus Elite series has two motherboards, right? So this is the B760 Orsus Elite AX and there is another version that's called B760 Orsus Elite. So what makes these two motherboards different is B760 Orsus Elite AX does have a uh, Wi-Fi connection support. So basically this motherboard comes with an, well, Wi-Fi 6 antenna which you can connect it with the motherboard and this motherboard will get the full Wi-Fi support. Port. So this is the, basically the only difference between the Elite AX and a B760 Elite motherboard. Now let's talk about the connectivity for this motherboard. Well, this motherboard comes with four USB 2.0 ports and the Wi-Fi layout as we said earlier, the Wi-Fi pins. There's two of them, it's a Wi-Fi 6 port. So we've got a HDMI port and a DP port just below the Wi-Fi uh, antennas. And after that we've got the USB Type-C. 10 GB port. So this one can transfer data with 10 GB PS per second and you have got the BIOS USB 3.0 type A port. So basically if you have a BIOS chip you can queue flash from here. Then you have got the USB 3.2 port, two USB 3.2 uh, port below that. Just below that you have got another two sets of USB 3.2 ports and a 2.5 G Ethernet port and just below that you have a input for mic and a line out and SPDIF out or you can say op for optical devices, optical uh, sound devices, you've got a port for that as well. So this is the connectivity for this motherboard 
This was my first impression for the B760 Aorus Elite AX motherboard which is now available in the BD market. Whenever you are purchasing a Gigabyte product, make sure you look at the smart authentication sticker. So this was my first impression video of the B760 Aorus Elite AX DDR4 version motherboard available in the Bangladesh market at the moment. I hope you like this video. If you do, please make sure you like and subscribe to our channel and to stay updated on the videos dropping soon. This is Ghazi Rahman signing off. I'm going to see you on the next one.